Hi everybody, Taya here from Quilting Delights and I am so excited to be here to share with you our latest innovation from Quilting Delights for the Bernina BSR. You know that we have come out with the BSR compatible ruler work feet and those have been incredibly popular. We've sold thousands of them. We have gotten such rave reviews and feedback about those feet, but something was missing and I couldn't quite put my finger on it. And I thought about it and I lost sleep and I could not figure out what was bugging me. And finally it dawned on me when I was working on the quilting primer, which is our project of um, quilting for uh, the BSR compatible attachments. And the thing that was bothering me was that I did not like using rulers for doing stitch in the ditch. I just can't quite seem to get that right. So we put our collective heads together and lo and behold, we have now a stitch in the ditch attachment that is compatible with the Bernina stitch regulator and it is awesome. Just as a side note, asterisk, we are coming out with generic stitch in the ditch feet for all free motion quilting on long arms, sit down machines and domestic sewing machines of all brands the first part of July. But right now I just have been so excited about this and we actually sent out an email last week. We got hundreds of orders, but we also got hundreds of requests for videos. So that's why I'm doing this today impromptu at my house. The actual filming will occur next weekend with our wonderful videographer, Margot Kelly, and we will get some really great, better videos out for you. But I want you to see how cool this foot is. And I, um, I only have a thousand of them ordered. Um, for the first run and we are offering a 10% off promotion plus free shipping in the USA and a flat rate of $16 overseas and you want to take advantage of that because it's only going to last until July 31st or when we run out of our first thousand units which I have a feeling is going to be before July 31st. These will start shipping August 1st and um, let's start talking about how they work. A couple of things that um, brought this to my attention uh, that we needed this. One is um, they say that uh, necessity is the mother of invention, but for me it's not true. Usually it's irritation is the mother of invention. And I was noticing how irritated I was getting trying to go around with a ruler and it just wasn't working for me. So we came up with an attachment that is compatible with the stitch regulator. You can see how it fits on here. And it actually has rudders that are uh, 90 degrees off of each other so you can do all of your straight lines up and down and your side waistlines but it's even better than that because what happens is so for example you can see that I have a small square here so let me just raise my foot now at home I sew on a Bernina 580 I like the smallness of it I use it pretty much just for piecing but um, for tonight it's going to be perfect for showing you how to do this. Again, I have my Sew Steady table. I do not have my gloves, but um, a little bit of Gold Bond hand lotion does the trick. Let me put a little bit of that on. That'll uh, make my hands a little bit stickier. There we go. Now, I don't always recommend that you put hand lotion on before you start on a quilt, but this is my quilt and it's been a sample quilt and um, I'm fine with that. Okay, now remember we're going to bring all of our quilt up to work on so that we don't have any drag on it. So see how free and easy this is to do. But when I use a ruler to try and do this, I still am fighting where am I positioning and how am I starting? Well, now I don't have to worry about that because I've got rudders front and back and we made the opening in this foot a little bit bigger. The actual foot is gonna be white, and we chose to do that because we don't want you to confuse it size-wise with the medium size one for the stitch regulator. Um, what you'll notice is I can use the side rudders, I can use the side rudders to tell me where the corner of this um, block is that I'm gonna stitch in the ditch. So I've got it positioned there. I'm gonna needle up, needle down, and lo and behold, it is almost in the corner. Um, never works quite right on video, but you'll get the gist of it here in just a second. So I'm lining up my rudder on the left-hand side, and I'm lining up my rudder on the front, and I've got my threads up, and I'm just going to start my stitch regulator, and... Oh, sorry, I forgot to put my feed dogs down. There we go. And I'm going to start my stitch regulator. And I am just literally running the rudder all the way down that seam until the side rudders match up with 
the seam right here. And then I'm going to start it again and I'm going to go left and that side rudder is going to help me figure out where the stitch in the ditch is. And then when my front rudder gets to the seam, I'm going to stop it. And the only reason I'm stopping it is because it's easier for me to transition from uh, forward back and side to side with that set. And then I'm going to run backwards and I'm going to just, and I'm watching where my rudder is. I'm not watching the needle. The needle knows what to do. It's going to go up and down. And then I'm going to go to the right and I'm going to match up with my, um, and again, I'm just following the rudder. I'm not doing anything more than following the rudder in that ditch. And then when it lines up with the beginning again here, I'm going to raise my foot and look at that. Look how tight, um, look how close it is to the edge. So um, it doesn't take very much practice to get good at this. We've also added a um, slot for the thread because I don't like mess. I want my threads to be able to go up and down under the foot easily. And this is on a really small square. So you can imagine it's much easier on a big square. But these rudders are what make it work. We have filed for app um, patent applications on these. Um, so we have patents pending. We're very excited about that. I think this is maybe my sixth or seventh patent um, for tools, and we are just jazzed. Make sure you jump on our website, quiltingdelights.com, and you can see um, just a couple of paragraphs down, you'll see a picture of this and a link where you can go in and order it for yourself. Make sure you get in on that first thousand and get the 10% off in free shipping. We will have more projects. It does come with a free pattern, by the way, I forgot to mention that. We will have more projects um, to go with this foot and other exciting innovations that are coming to you soon. Thanks a lot and we'll, we'll see you real soon.